Hello everyone, welcome to Yotpedia Global. So in this video, I'm going to discuss with you all one very good opportunity that is joint PhD program and this initiative is with the collaboration of IIT Delhi and University of Queensland Australia. So after completing this program, you will be awarded with joint PhD degree from these two institutions and during this program, you will get opportunity to you know interact with the supervisors and eminent professors of these two world class institutions. So now let us see who all are eligible for this joint PhD program and let me make one thing very clear March 15 is the deadline if you want to apply you need to submit your EOI expression of interest and how you will write that expression of interest that is very very important because that is somewhere going to be very important in deciding your candidate. Obviously you need to summarize why you want to join this program and what motivation you had for this program, how this program will be helping you to achieve your long term objective and many such things. So that is the space basically where the mentors of Europedia Global will guide you in better relevant and appropriate way how to write an effective expression of interest on the basis of your academic journey from your school education to till date. So whenever some international university ask you to write these kind of document, don't write them in you know unnecessary, irrelevant and inappropriate way. You must have clarity what information you want to convey about your candidate and how to write your skill, your potential, your ability, achievement and past experiences that play a very important role in your selection for the next stages. So now moving ahead, let us see who all are eligible to apply for this as an Indian and international student for this joint PhD program. You can see here, it's clearly mentioned that in eligibility section, if I go, what is your eligibility? So it's a qualifying degree, it's a basically general requirement and then any score required or not in the standard examination. You can see your bachelor degree in engineering and technology. See, they have the project in technology, they have the project in engineering, they have the project in management, they have the project in healthcare, they have the project in sciences, they have the project in humanities and social sciences. So diverse domain projects are there available. You can apply, explore the website of this UQ Australia. And you can see in eligibility section, they had mentioned if you are holding bachelor, your CGPA must be 8 on the 10 scale or aggregate percentage of 80% and it's a first class degree awardation, right? And similarly, there is no requirement of any standard examination like GATE and UGC. If you have done your graduation from the CFTI, Centrally Funded Technical Institution, but in case your university's college is not under CFTI, then you need to have a GATE score or UGC net score and then there are other scores also mentioned. So recently GATE exam was concluded and I believe you all are looking ahead for some good opportunity like this joint PhD program which is an initiative of UQ and IITD Research Academy. This is one of the very good program where you will get opportunity to interact with the professors and to work and network with two world class institution all together for very good four to five number of years. So guys, if you are interested to pursue PhD and you want to get the research flavor from these two world class renowned institution, then don't miss this opportunity. Deadline is 15th of the March. So go and apply and start writing your expression of interest in the well appropriate way. If you face any of the difficulty in writing expression of interest, you can connect us through you know our uh, executive. You can uh, put the, your query in the comment section. Our executive will be approaching you and you can see it's clearly mentioned here what all projects they are giving you people, right? So if you belong to diverse background, then you can also find the project here. You can see this is mentioned a project, find a project, available project for commencing from the July intake are advertised on our website. So you can apply for up to two projects in your expression of interest form. You cannot propose your own or apply directly to the school of department. Means whatever project list they have given. So basically you can apply for up to two projects out of them and you can write your expression of interest around those two projects. It's clearly mentioned here, right? 
Each available project include a project title, description, detail of the supervision team and expected student background and other key project. When you will be going through the list of the project, there you will find in detail what is the title of project and what is the description and who all are the potential supervisor contributing into that project and what are their prerequisite, what they are expecting from you as a candidate. Then accordingly you need to start writing your expression of interest. So first go for the website and see what are the project available. Third, which all projects are aligning with your past experiences and future aspirations. Then fourth, start writing your expression of interest for at least two projects. Like this, you can maximize your selection chances for this prestigious PhD program. So we wish you all the best. Thank you.